This is one of the best combination routes. As far as I'm aware of, this is the best for items. Uh, the Kuiper, as well as pretty decent XP, but I'm going to warn you, it's not going to be, like, super easy to access, because you will need to be a little bit tanky, like, you'll have to have some good mods, but you'll also have to have access to White Knight Gulch, so basically, White Knight Gulch, shipment base, you can TP over here, and then just walk over here to the Fortress Outskirts, so there's probably a lot of people already farming this, but, uh, this is by a long shot the best, so, our bunny is only level 10 right now, but, uh, Watch how much uh, XP Kuiper that we get. So Kuiper, we're at 13,000, right? We already just got one uh, one gold star item. You don't really need to shoot here. Uh, I'm still leveling up, so I won't have like the most perfect cooldowns and stuff, but you don't really need that much stats. Like we got another uh, star item. The reason why I just say star item is it, it it's kind of like on Diablo, how a star appears on the minimap. But in this game, technically they're called ultimates. You know, legendaries, ultimates, whatever you want to call them. So, you're going to go over here after you kill some monsters. You're going to activate all of these. But you don't even really need to complete it. Because we're here just really for the Kuiper, not necessarily the mission rewards. But we're going to activate all of these, and we're not going to stand in. But as far as I'm aware of, this is one of the like top tier areas for everything in the game. Uh, like a, a good mixture of things. I'm going to kill these monsters real quick, and then we're going to go back over to B. Let's go activate this. But we just basically run around. And even if I don't happen to have my sprint, and you can do this for several minutes. You can walk in the center if you want to, eventually, and start completing it a little bit. But as long as we have our activation up, up of our AoE, we'll be okay. You can also get, if you are playing Bunny, and Bunny's a really easy character to like unlock, obviously. But you need to be able to pick up the uh, HPs, and that's how we are going to sustain ourselves. But once you get going uh, with some extra mana, it'll be way easier. You can see, we already just leveled up. And it's way better than the, the, the base defense mode. The reason... But the base defense mode is technically the easiest XP. So it's good for pretty much everything. And do this as Bunny because it's just way more efficient. Because Bunny is like really, really OP uh, for just killing like the trash mobs. And this is already in hard mode. But we'll, we'll be okay. Just make sure you pick up the HPs. Ideally, get some defense. That's also good. You can see there's another. There's two more uh, ultimates on the floor, aka legendaries. You can see in the top left those little stars. But right now we don't. The thing that we're missing for this build to feel way smoother is MP uh, cost reduction, as well as skill radius. I don't have like the uh, the upgrade where you get more modules yet. Basically, I mean, it's pretty easy. We've already gained two, two levels, right? Basically, you can just repeat this. You can see there's another person that just joined in. And if you complete the mission, it's not a big deal. Uh, now, is it better to complete it? Honestly, it depends on what you want. Like, if you need one of the drops from this mission and you're trying to farm it, then by all means, complete it as many times as possible. But, like, I'm just here for the items. Look at all those items. So... I would do this quick before it gets nerfed because the density in this area is just too good and it doesn't have like a boss that's just going to absolutely obliterate you and we're one-shotting pretty much everything. But also, we'll, we'll do a one little quick full run here so you guys get the idea of it. And then, on top of that, uh, I'll show you all the equipment. So if you want to run this, you can see what we're doing. You don't even need any weapons to be honest. In fact, uh, I have defensive stats on the weapon, which I still need to upgrade. That's why I'm doing this farm route. But really, really good. Getting items and everything. Just, just deleting everything. We got another ultimate. Another ultimate just dropped on the map. <laughs> yeah, I feel like this is definitely going to be one of the best farming routes for ultimates. Look at that. Oh, it just made another ding sound. Oh, yeah, another ultimate just dropped. I heard another ding, another ultimate. Like, 
We have another person that just joined up. You'll you'll find a lot of people doing this too. So I would do this ASAP, man. It actually might be harder if I hold still, but eventually you'll start to complete them. You'll see that uh, you'll have to pick up one of these items and you put it over there. It looks like one of the other guys completed it. But you can see in just a few minutes, I guess it was that, like five minutes, it's gained a few levels. Oh, we gotta deliver the uh, payload over here. And then we gotta grab the last one. So there's four of these. Each one has one. And again, since the density is so high, just make sure you have some defenses. So we'll throw that one in. Oh, he's gotta throw the last this one in. More than enough. It'll help a lot. Thank you. There we go. But you could just reset at this point. Uh, looks like someone killed some, something else over here. Careful. Focus but this part is where if you wanted to, I guess, abandon and reset, that's up to you. But there's not really anything that's like super hard here. But you can see the whole time we are able to, even at low level, upkeep our stuff. Look at that. Two, two golds just dropped off that guy too. So, alright, so I think we're pretty much safe now, and then, again, we would just go back, you see the person's doing it right now, because this is the best for, like, basically everything, and I wanted to show you guys the full route, but you can see, we started at, what, dude, I think 10, right? So, we gained several levels, uh, we gained, I want to say, over 10,000 Kuiper, uh, and then on top of that, all of the stuff, I'm pretty sure I just cleaned up my inventory, but look at how many ultimates we just got. So this could be a really good area. If you want to farm a very specific one, you can do it. You can open up the, the map and kind of choose more stuff. But basically, that's the that's the route. That's the run. And as far as what we have on Bunny, um, the thing that I can recommend is obviously to play Bunny. If you have any defensive things, there are ones like Defense Master, which I'm actually in the process of leveling this up. And this works with skill kills, not necessarily only gun kills. So this is how we're going to scale way more defense earlier on uh, without having to sacrifice our modules because um, obviously you need to run specifically things like cooldown reduction. Um, you also want to run uh, uh, skill duration. So in combination, getting uh, skill duration, I don't know which one I have, one of them. Okay, this is, oh, of course we're getting attacked during this. Someone else has started the thing. All right, well, we're going to end up doing this again. Hopefully we can uh, go over everything and not get distracted here. But uh, you want cooldown reduction. Uh, if, if you do happen to have the upgraded bunny, like you bought the thing or whatever, you upgraded into it uh, with the uh, module up. Uh, yeah, cooldown reduction is great. And then also uh, MP, uh, any, any sort of thing in between. Ma max MP is totally fine. Also... Um, there's also like uh, uh, MP like cost reduction. So any combination of those will be good. There's also range. So range can ex extend the size of your skills. Uh, some of them you'll have to make sure that it only it applies to the correct one. Uh, but basically those are the things that you want to look out for and you cannot skip out on defense. Okay, that's very important. But that's basically the farm route and that's what we're running and everyone can play this. It's, it's bunny, everyone has bunny. Like you get her within the first hour. So that's the best XP, it's the best combo of everything as far as I'm aware of. So do that right now. And uh, yeah, you'll definitely get a huge advantage in the game.